Hello fuck stumps, Jim Sterling here with a game called Unearthed Trail of Ibn Battuta. Battuta. Ibn Battuta. Sorry, I said it wrong the first time. How are you all? I'm not very well. Okay, I've come down with something, which is annoying, because today was the day I record all my dialogue for Jazz Punk, the upcoming game that nearly everyone's talking about. Uh, so I... And I had to do voices that were very much like that. Uh, shredded my throat. But I am dedicated to bringing you people games to have a look at. So this one was suggested to me... What? Manual? semi That'll do. Uh, this game was suggested to me on Twitter by a person who said, It's worse than Gary's Incident, so you should play it. Uh, I'm always up for a challenge, so let's play while I'm not feeling too hot. Uh, the most amazing secret of all in the age of exploration Unearthed Trail of Ibn Battuta Oh shit, not Jeff Rosick Alright, this is looking up Katie Crown Where are they getting these names from? Not David Lodgers, Rashid Al Kabami. Fuck me. Well, I wasn't sold on this until I saw those big hitting names. And to think that it's a journey through generations of a great nation's memory as well, I just. Good God. And we get the title screen again. That's. Oh. Oh my God. I. Oh. Oh, is that cum? I can smell my own cum! So much of it came out with excitement of the thing that I am seeing on the screen on my computer. Some secrets are worth adventuring for. Or so they say. Looking at where this one got me so far... <laughs> mumbling it. My own take on the subject. Look at me, me. And I shouldn't be making fun of voice Jamal, actors, because you know? I am now technically one. Because I did voice acting for a game. Like Jessica Chobot. I am now the Jessica Chobot of video games, because my voice will be in jazz punk. I'll be playing two characters in the Adult Swim published game. Oh shit, the game's here! Okay, let's do this. Space continue. So, do that, and do that. Let's go. The uh, alarm system is in time with the music. That's very uh, considerate. You can take cover behind walls. Request Move to... Anchor. Press C near cover to use it. I can do that for you. He moves a lot quicker against the wall. Use uh, thingy to thingy and thingy to thingy. Bullseye. Oh, so he's uh, injured and in trouble, but he's got time to make cheap uh, wisecracks. Not even a wisecrack. You will form blind fire by firing without aiming. Why would I do that? Just bullseye him. Press C again to leave cover. I can do that for you. So far... The action is, you know, the highest of all octanes. Oh. I was a bit overzealous with my uh, firing there. I'm just so excited by the adrenaline pumping uh, cavalcade of mesmerizing sequences. You can pick up new items when I'm pressing. I've already figured that one out, Doc. The music's actually, like, legit not too bad. Come on me! Come on me! I'll cover you in bullets! While in cover, press point towards a nearby cover and press space to go there quickly. Oh, wait. There. Oh, there we go. To throw a grenade, I hold that and press G. Alright. Oh! <laughs> Did you see him go with the thing? Oh dear. Oh, no, actually, I want that. Okay, here we go. As we limp nimbly to the. where? Did we go on the elevator? No. He trips over their bodies. I guess we just go back down the corridor. The trouble is, is he's moving so slowly right now. 
If we uh, go the wrong way, it's a long trek back. back Some environment objects can be used for tactical advances. Look for flashing objects. <laughs> Fucking everything was flashing! And press T to perform a takedown. <laughs> Brilliant! Checkpoint reached. Okay, so we have... I mean, this game is putting Vin Diesel to fucking shame. Oh my god, we get hand-to-hand -hand combat as well. This... Jesus, this game has not stopped providing... Hold that to block, punch, kick, camera. Okay. It's all in the mind. That was a reference to an old game. That's how you do a let's play. You you do a, know a game that has happened, and then you say from that game words. I'm not very well. Give me a break. I don't know why I was doing that tactically. I'm sure you can get through those just by smacking buttons. Again? Oh, maybe not. Yeah, because they just trade blows. There we go. Smack him in the head. Take that. You devoid. Oh shit, we've got a gun that is Hold worse on, than Dania. the one I was holding. I'm going to get you out of here. And has disappeared. Oh, we've got to get Dania. Come on, we can do it. Kapow. You can do it. I believe in you, Jawad. Oh shit, Stone Cold! Stone Cold! Now what would you do if you were me? I'd get fucking Steve Austin's autograph. First and foremost. And then I'd say, you know. Uh, you're a violent man, Steve. Rein it in. You know, if I was Sylvester Sloan, I wouldn't have given you the job on the Expendables, because I don't think you're sorry for the things you've done. But, my sister's a big fan. She's called Jim. Can you sign this LP? And then I'd hand him an LP. Maybe Fun. The band Fun. LP. Or that one Billy Bob Thornton did. I realise I'm talking more bollocks than I normally talk. So, I'm... this is Amos' temple. Yep, that's the one. 3,560 I'm... years of history. I'm talking like they're moving. You have to be careful and watch your steps in there. My steps? You mean you're not coming in with me? No, I just mean that you are moving the like a fucking the puppet the without the strings. Reading tombs and uncharting mysteries in video games. Now you get to do it yourself. <gasps> they made a reference to video games. It's very self-referential oh, and okay. funny. So you were telling me that actual consideration for my well-being... <laughs> oh, you. Good to know someone will come and extract my body in case the quick load button doesn't work. Oh my Relax. god. Don't... Oh, uh, really? Sister, always been taking care of you like a baby. Well... Except for when As you know, I'm your elder sister. But still, I'm your elder sister. Your, your elder sister? That's me. And guide your way through. I will be the voice in your head. Oh, like a video game nice. sometimes when they do it, right? It's all wrapped into one. Remind me again, Donia, what am I risking my life for? Your life and my For some time. points in a video game, because we are a video game, don't forget. Son of Obama, who led the Egyptian army to get the hexes out of Egypt Son of Obama? As gratitude, the pharaoh ordered the construction of this temple to honor him, and almost chose a location overlooking his hometown of Nekeb. Quite a view yeah, yeah, yeah. This is... What's so special about it? I'm sure the grave Skip to the end. clean ages ago. They picked what they thought was valuable. Almost acquired two golden daggers from one of his battles with the Hexus. He got so attached to them that he kept them in the tomb and made them into unlocking mechanisms. She loves archaeology so much it gives us seizures. Something of greater value, I presume? Exactly. An award he got for his courage called the Gold of Valor. It's a necklace with three pendants in the shape of flies made up of about half a pound of gold, making it one of the most valuable military decorations as well as the most ancient. 
I'm sure it's going to be a major break for This animation world. makes the and Thunderbirds look fucking us. sophisticated. I like your collective team spirit. Oh. Let's see where this takes us. Da 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 what secrets does this place hide? Secrets of how you're moving around without strings? Wow. You gotta see this, don't you? What is it? Well, I can tell you. It's a really but shit temple! Tell me! Only risk takers get to see such beauty. Is what the director told the graphical artists for this game. Hmm. So it's going to try and be uncharted. <clears throat> Is it? I don't know. Is there even anything? Sort of. This ancient fountain might be the key to progress. Based Maybe on I what evidence? Water flowing again somehow. That might help. What? Who thinks like that? Who goes into an old temple and then thinks, Oh god, if only I could make Maybe this up, that might help. ancient dry fountain work again. Then I'll open a door. Logic. That's a flashing thing. Okay, here we go. Oh god, really? Was that a shimmy? Yeah, that was a shimmy. Ugh. That's just creepy. Sweet. Why did it make the first bit of a transformer noise? Okay. Um, I don't know what to do. This isn't very good, is it? We need to find a way to unlock this huge gate. There must be a way to do that. Look around carefully. Well, I'm looking around, I'm looking around. Any climby bit I found so far was that fucking... little CD picked up. God, the camera is awful. <laughs> Uh. Is he doing more running? No. It's just the way he clashes over objects. Fair enough. Wow, that game got very impatient with me very quickly. Alright, I get it, I get it. Now. I can solve these things all by myself. Hold on. Um. No. Uh. 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 Oh. Uh. Uh. Help. I went through it! Oh, this is very troubling. That's got to be the right one. That's where the crack is. Come on. Do it. There we go. Ha ha. That, that was fucked up. Does this look as horrible as it feels to play? Because, ugh. It's that kind of thing where the controls are so stodgy and 
weird that it makes you shudder. There are certain games that do that to me. Just, ugh, I see a guy moving around like this and I'm just, ugh. I haven't felt this way since I played that fucking... Um, was it, was it Time Crisis on the... With the PlayStation Move? It had a proper free-moving first-person shooter mode. And it didn't work at all. And it was so awkward. I spent the whole thing just with my skin crawling. Certain game controls really just, just do that to me. I really don't want to do a thing that will lead to me falling down. Because no one needs to see any one section of this game more than once. Essentially. So what's this tabs here? Some artifacts may be located inside parts. Well done. Some of our artifacts maybe that's the same one. Oh. Oh, the game just tells you where all its hidden stuff is. What else do you do? I don't know, they're just gonna bang on about pots again. Huh. Trouble is that you can't move the camera when walking around, which really limits how useful it is. I mean, in a minute the game's going to get bored with me again and make me feel foolish. Oh, that's a thing. Hooray! Beginning to think this might be a video that requires some editing. Okay, I don't know what happened there, but but this is now a thing. Uh, he's still falling. Uh, as you can see, um, I wandered about for a bit, went to that area where the camera perspective changed. So I thought, well, there's got to be a thing to climb on here. So I thought, well, I'll jump around uh, for a bit and... Uh, this is a... God, he's going damn far away, isn't he? I'm just, I keep having to drag the camera down to try and get to him. Uh, I think we've got to reload that last checkpoint. <laughs> <sighs> yeah, 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 yeah. Right. Bear with me. I'm going to go climb up the thing again. Okay, so we've gone round. We did not jump through the wall again by accident, but we've gone down on this little ledge area here. Press E. Gonna shimmy ourselves down this ladder. How is he an explorer? I can get down a ladder better than that, and I look like John fucking Candy. Okay. What the fuck? It's just the same fucking... I... 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 Oh. I've got to find three more of these pieces. Sweet mother of fuck. All right, well, okay, two we, more. we know what we're doing now. Let's just run around and smash these fucking pots. <laughs> God, God. Where was that other one that they said? They gave us a clue that I didn't pay attention to. I thought they were just going to lag down walls. I realise now the folly of my behaviour. Actually, this will just fucking tell us everything. It's... It's not a game I feel like, you know, 
figuring out or hmm. playing. There we go. That's the one. I mean, just what? This, this isn't a puzzle. Yeah, where is it? Right, right. Okay, that. That's where's Waldo. Without Waldo. Where's Waldo with Waldo is pretty shit. Without it, it's pointless. More, to go. More pointless. We need to find a way to oh, unlock this up. huge gate. There must be a way to do that. Look around carefully. Because well, you've got to be in the exact same, the exact right position to fucking pick up a thing. Go on. There! Oh! Aha. It's just, it feels uncomfortable to play. Now. It's just so sloppy, all the interactions. Well Still done. pressing on. <laughs> Onward, Christian soldier! Whee! Creepy looking corridor leads. Whoa! Intense platforming action! Whoa! Intense platforming action! It's like the Mario Brothers or some shit. It's too dark for me to move on. I can't see a thing. Alright, well, let me have this then. Or not. Oh, hold on. There we go. Now we're in the exact right position that it wanted me to be in, where I have to play the game, guess what I'm thinking of with the developer. Oh, and he's got to move that at that speed with the torch, is he? Why not? Oh, dear Christmas. It's a bit of a far cry from the adrenaline pumping intro sequence. Very funny, Dahlia. Are you afraid of the dark? Remember that show from when we were young? Well done on the cultural reference. I do remember it. In fact, uh, a few weeks ago, I was at a... For some reason, a few of our local friends decided we'd do a pyjama party. I think I've mentioned this in an older video. Um, where we just hung around in a house wearing pyjamas. Watching Are You Afraid of the Dark episodes on YouTube. Oh, we're doing one of those balancey things. Oh, it's like 2002 never left us. Why is he walking like that? He's walking like a fucking chicken. He walks like exorcist crab on the walls and like monster chicken on things like that. Oh yeah, just put it down. You might never need it again. Uh-huh. Okay. Uh oh. <sighs> this game was released in the year 2014. Oh dear. 2014, everyone. Okay, these traps aren't all that. I think this is where, I think this is where the mummy is. These traps think they're so hot, but you know what? There are they're two not. Rooms to the left and right of it. Remember the two unlocking mechanisms I told you about? Oh my about god, I can't even move them. That's where they come in. You need to look for two golden daggers and use them to open this door. Two golden daggers. Got it. That shouldn't be too hard to find in this place. Or should it? 
Donia, I see a statue holding a golden dagger up above. That was easy. Try to find a way to get to it. Let's, yes, let's. Really, and how am I supposed to do that? With those stairs I can see right there. Use your monkey skills. Whoa, racist. Well, at least the monkey always gets the banana in the end. In fact, two in this case. I'd like to see his, uh, evidence for that assertion that the monkey always gets the banana Steady. in the end. Almost there. I don't want to be hanging around with the same monkeys as him. Or rather, I wouldn't want to be a monkey and hang around with him if... <laughs> hanging around with him as a monkey means you always get a banana in your end. Now this is interesting, because we're basically trying to guess using very unhelpful perspectives. Just a little more. I mean, I'm assuming that should be fine. Oh, that's making me sick. It makes me sick just looking at him move. Here we go. Wait, how the fuck did he see that statue? He wasn't even looking up here. I thought it was referencing him somehow. I know he wasn't holding a dagger, but I'm like, well, you know, this game being this game, there's a uh, every chance he's just supposed to be holding one. Instead, it was this guy. And again with that transformer noise. Right. Okay, Donnie. Oh, I see one of the statues again. holding Fuck. the dagger on the other side of the room. Where? There must be a way to get across it, but it doesn't look so safe for me to climb down and look for it, though. And even if I did, I don't think I will be able to climb up again. Hmm, let me see. Then in this case, you can use the RC car I bought a while ago. The what? remote control has a small screen that will help you what? control it better. What? Why? All right, I'll give it a try. Uh, where is it again? I put it in your backpack. I knew it may come in handy at some point. What kind of remedial? Cool. What else did you put in there? Puts toys in someone's backpack well, in the hopes you actually care to check your that they'll need it yeah. to get a mummy. Uh, I'm not even going to think about it. Oh, it's just down there already. She went... It wasn't in his backpack. She went in this temple first, did all the puzzles, put the car down there, went back out, rearming the traps and shit as she went. What a bastard she is. Brilliant. Brilliant. Hey, nani I, I literally can't believe I'm doing this. This is a thing that I'm seeing and feeling my fingers on the keyboard, and I literally cannot believe that this is this has happened to me. Those pharaohs couldn't just put the daggers at the entrance now. Nice. <laughs> How did he speak two words at once? Is what I want to know. Video games. And we gotta go the back again, yeah? Yeah. Of course we do. Of course, in the olden days in Egypt, only pharaohs had access to remote controlled cars. Which is why they designed fucking traps like this. How does he get the car back? Are they going to explain that? I guarantee you there's a puzzle later that uses that car that he's not going to retrieve. Unless he does, which is going to look foolish. Nope! Huh? Oh, i got to walk away and then walk back to get the prompt again to do... Jesus Christ. It'll be alright. It's alright. It's alright, Chip. You can stop playing this whenever you want. No one's making you do this. Well, well. Would you look at that? It's a very fancy scarf on Anubis there. 
Forrest, I'm losing the signal. I just saw a group of armed men enter the tomb. They're... They're raiding what? the tomb! Donia? Okay, I should probably finish quickly. Yeah, I've said that many times. This game doesn't deserve to have that music, by the way, that exciting, intrepid music. It's going to be attributed to us. Really? Technically, I did all the work. This better be worth it. It, it doesn't look worth it so from where I'm sitting, to be honest. It does not look worth it. Just give it to the men with the guns and, and never do this again. Just sit at home and watch telly. Brilliant. Oh, we're doing this again. Ugh. Loading. You've nothing to load. How did you miss that? How are you missing? I, I, oh, uh, stop being bad, please. This is awful. It's so frustrating. He just keeps missing even while making contact. Hit him! You fool! Why did he go oh, when nothing hit him? Oh my god, I don't understand this game. I'm not imagining it. This fight literally doesn't work, right? Nothing about this works as it should. I... I, I don't know what that was. I won't forgive myself if something happened to her. Good or bad. He likes to keep her in this state of complete stasis. Jesus Christ. I'm empty. Cover me while I reload. That sound is coming from everywhere. I literally don't know. It was coming from like the side, but behind me a bit. I that just confused and upset me. Oh no! We're gonna have to just go for the takedown. Now we're talking. I'm. You'll notice I'm not even saying much. I I don't have much to say anymore. <laughs> I have to get out of cover. The cover system is not working when trying to shoot this guy. Was that really so hard? 
Fucking Jesus. What gun is that? Oh my god, you fucking idiot! I... I can't... Fuck it! Jesus fucking Christ! Wouldn't even turn around properly to get to the fucking thing! The word stodgy isn't even good enough for this. The word stodgy does not adequately... Ah! Uh, uh, it's the noise that should be made. Thank God these flares are here. Because we all know that he can't run and hold a torch at the same fucking time. But hey, at least we get to do the exact same slow traversal across a ledge that we did on the way here. Why have ideas when you can just do the same thing? Sometimes the, the character just has better ideas of where to move than I do. Except they're not better ideas because where he wants to go is nowhere and where I want to go is the right way. This costs money to buy. They're charging for this. How? Okay, well that didn't work. I mean, you know, the gun was aimed right at him. So the gun I picked up was... Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. Good. 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 I'm glad that happened. What? What? I... I guess he tried to throw a grenade and did the exact same thing I did? You see, they go down really easy uh, if you can actually fucking aim at them. It's actually getting the targeting reticule to recognise that they're in the targeting reticule that's the challenge. Ba boom ba boom ba boom ba boom ba boom ba boom Like there, you see, like actually aiming at his body showed the target in white. I had to fucking shoot just a bit on his shoulder for it to work. Oh I see. They want this to be stealthy. Something tells me the stealth system's not gonna work too well, but you never know. Still no sign of the turkey. Oh god! Okay, maybe it won't be so difficult. Considering they clearly have no AI whatsoever. Brilliant. No sign of movement, stay sharp. I'm gonna switch to this just in case this goes south. I wanna see just how bad we can exploit this. Oh, oh well. We got close enough. Ah, oh, that was easy because the the game decided I was allowed to shoot him. Some, as I said, sometimes it doesn't. Oh, is there another guy in here? I oh, know they're just outside, but there's no actual positioning of sound. Oh, where the hell are they? Ah, there we go. Okay. Now, if we can just... Hooray! Oh, someone's still alive. 
Or was that just a dead body saying that? It's hard to tell. Yeah. Oh! Shot him in the dick. Achievement Ooh, unlocked. Finally made it. it doesn't feel like an achievement. Did she hide inside the car, maybe? Better hope not. So, you have an accomplice on the outside. Steve Austin! That explains a lot of things. Who are you? That is none of your concern. You definitely saved us the trouble of solving all those puzzles. What, like Dagger goes in Dagger Hole? After all, now, and me. <laughs> he did nothing worth sparing his go. life for. Catch. I'm saying this is the guy who's playing him. Oh, God. Here we go. Boss fight. <laughs> Sorry, that amuses me just to say it. <sighs> unearthed. And it's only just hit me that it's called Unearthed because it sounds a bit like Uncharted, actually. Ah. Oh, shit. Is that the beginning of Relax, Don't Do It? Or West End Girls. West End Girls. There we go. God. Just people just punching through each other. This is like how ghosts would fight. It's like, even drunk barroom brawlers would look at this and say, they're doing it wrong. Oh. There we go. The, the kicks seem to be unblockable, but when I kick, I don't seem to hit anyone. Let's try. Oh, we got him! There we go. Give him the stunner. You should have accepted my offer while you had the chance. Drop it. Careful with this thing, little one. You might get yourself hurt. He'll pay you for his institutionalized misogyny. More worries, big guy. See, I'm with her. I mean, she's with me. Come on, Dania. Let's get out of here. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, now, God knows what kind of bite that's supposed to be. Uh-huh. Well, that was unearthed. Uh, hope you liked it. Uh, oh, oh. Oh, I'm so... Should we? Let's do the, the bike sequence, come on. Let, let's treat ourselves. We've waited this long for some fucking action, we might as well enjoy it. Hooray! We are the best at quad bike! Well, wow, that is obscenely shaky. Oh. The camera there. Uh, well, the, the, the graphics cut there, so I couldn't see the explosion. Gypped. Got to see that one. Wasn't worth it, was it? Not really. Heads up. The heads are up. Helicopter! God, it's exactly like that section in Half-Life 2. I don't I don't know if I was actually supposed to shoot that or not. Got to be kidding me. Bullets won't 
Take it down! Shoot the tower! I'm trying! God, that controls were not wanting to work with me there. You really do just, you, you pray for the best when you try and shoot anything in this game. It's just, you hope it will let you do it. Meanwhile, yes. with Cobra. We got there, but some guy beat us to it. Don't worry, we will follow them right away. What do you mean, forget about it? My men will get them by the hour. All right, all right, but this better be good. Call out the rest of the men. Tell them we will move to Morocco right away. I will hunt them in every corner of the world. I will flip every rock in every desert. And when I find them, they will beg me for death. You haven't seen the last of me, you two. I swear, next time, you won't be so lucky. Well, I mean, you're never going to get out of that desert. You if you're gonna flip good. every fucking rock in it. I did good? Did you even see the fear in that guy's eyes? I bet they were even too afraid to follow us and... We have good mobile coverage here? Wow. Why is this still up? Any... This is as far as Chawad speaking. I'm going. This isn't even worth reaching the end of. I... Thank you for watching Hello, me play My name is Rashid on Earth. I'm Jesus. From Morocco, uh, I, believe I, have I hope you got something out of it. For you, my friend. I'm going to go and lie down and, and work on my being sick. So. A very interesting proposition. He's not going to suck you off.